Hi there, in Wellington this week and working with the government agency efforts here and I had a great week. Uh, really awesome team that were engaged in the work that we were doing. And one of the things that were reflected on that was we really want to think talk about buy-in for just a couple of minutes. One of the things I find extraordinary is that when uh, managers or leaders try and get buy-in from people, they think they have to pitch or sell. And the whole idea there is that we think we've got to convince people. So we'll use data or PowerPoint slides and talk at them for a while but it really doesn't allow people to buy in. The term buy in itself is almost like management speak these days, but what it really comes from is the game of poker. And that is, if I want to join into a game of poker, I have to buy into that game. I'm the one that makes the choice about whether I take, put my hand in my wallet and buy into that game or not. No one can convince me. In fact, the more that somebody wants to convince me to buy in, the less likely I am that I want to do it. So with buy-in, and when we're trying to get buy-in from people in our organisation, whether it's into developing our results and our measures and our measurement systems, or whether it's about building our customer strategy or even the architecture for customer engagement, we have to engage people. We've got to engage people in the process of the development of these things. We have to engage people in getting feedback on what we've developed so that they have the opportunity to contribute, they've got the opportunity to um, have input, put feedback into it, and the whole, all that sort of information. The whole idea is that we've got to engage people in the process. The process of development, the process of reviewing, and not locking it in and saying, this is it, what do you think? We're in the development of these things. So that's how we get buy-in. And we use open space technology in Pump, for example, with a measure gallery. But the whole process that we're developing any of these things with has to be engaging people and it has to engage them in the process and engage them in the development of these things, listening to their ideas and really using their input to improve the outputs that we get. Anyway, I hope this has been of value and thanks for watching.